security system is poor. It's very, very poor. The country don't promote, number one, when it comes to talent. We have talent in this country. We have game. What, what, what I don't really like about the country is how politicians do that things. How they made the country to be like, if you import it, you can't do anything. Some people say the president is not working. Some people say the president is not working. I want to go there and see our labor. The president is working? Yeah. I beg you, and you see the Kiwi at the DRZ. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Like always, I'm your favorite Liberian boy, Fizzle. In today's video, we're going to be talking about living in Liberia and what it takes to live in Liberia. So, guys, by no way is this video a rent video. I'm not here to bash my country or talk bad about my country. I'm just here to tell you, like, what it takes to live in Liberia as a young individual or as a person. Let's just say as a person. So, me personally, I would like to, I like to divide things into two. I like to tell you the good things and the bad ones. But let's start with the bad ones first. You understand? Let's get the bad one out of the way and then we go to the good old jolly old nice parts of living in Liberia. So if you're planning on coming to Liberia to live with family, loved ones and friends, there are a few things you need to know and there are a few things you need to accept <laughs> when you want to live in Liberia. And the reason why I'm laughing is some people find it really like really strange. You understand? Some people find it really strange. Like when I tell them these things, they're like, what? Really? Are you sure? Oh my God. Liberia is a very unique country. And I'll be telling you some things that, you know, you have to keep in mind if you're coming to settle back in Liberia as a Liberian or you're from another country, another uh, uh, um, national coming to settle in Liberia. So first of all, if you don't know where Liberia is, Liberia is a country located in West Africa. Liberia is also a country that went through a lot of years of war and that resulted to its infrastructure being destroyed and a lot of its citizens migrating into different countries. I'm one of the people who migrated. I was a kid, the war started and my mom took me. I grew up in Nigeria and some other parts of West Africa. But you know, I'm back now. And ever since I've been back 2005, the country has been improving at a very slow pace. But I'm here to tell you, you know, like what's up? So first off, electricity is a problem. Like it's not that we don't have electricity. There is electricity in Liberia, but consistency is a problem. One minute you have light, the next minute you don't. Another one is transportation, like moving around Liberia. Me, I'm in Monrovia, the capital city of Liberia. So moving around Monrovia, it's not quite easy if you don't have your own car. And then when you do have your own car, the traffic is massive in the morning and in the evening to go to town. In the morning, it's, it's, it's massive when you're going to town. In the evening, it's massive when you're coming back from town. That's another bad part of living in Monrovia, Liberia. The next one I would like to talk about is uh, mm, the price of food in Liberia. Food is uh, quite expensive especially when it comes to vegetables and stuff because Liberia don't like grow their own food such as rice rice is a stable food in, like, food in Liberia you understand and rice is not being grown here rice is being imported from another country to Liberia so the price of a bag of rice is really expensive so if you're a foreigner and you're used to eating rice and you're coming to Liberia just know that it's going to be a little bit higher than what you expected in price vegetables too are quite expensive because not all of them are grown here you understand and even the ones that are grown here they are grown at a lower scale you understand that's another one you need to think about another thing is if you don't know Liberia uses dual currency which means we use the Liberian dollars and we use the US dollars the bad part about that is the rates, the rate is always fluctuating. It's always going up and down. One minute, the rate is 175. The next minute is 180. The next minute, it drop down to 150. The next minute is, you understand? So the prices of things are always going up and down. That's something you need to keep in mind too because we don't always use US dollars. Sometimes we use Liberian dollars and we use both currency in the same country at the same time. Not Well, not at the same time. If you want to buy small small stuff, you buy it in Liberian dollars. If you want to buy big things like car and a house, you buy it in US dollars, but the rate is not stable. It's always up and down. And because of that, the prices of things are always fluctuating and going and moving up the scale or down the skill so you need to keep that in mind too if you if you're coming to liberia to live keep that in mind my guy <laughs> all right so the next thing we want to talk about is the road connectivity in liberia liberia don't have states or province we have counties now most of the roads in liberia are not connected some of them are really bad let me just tell you there's no road there even you understand what i mean so traveling within liberia is a problem that's the next thing you need to know so uh if you're coming to liberia this is one thing you need to keep in mind road connectivity is a problem 
so now that we've highlighted you know the the bad parts of this video let's talk about the good things you know why i love living in liberia so much do you understand the first thing i'd like to talk about is accommodation the pricing of housing in liberia is by far better than any other place i used to live in south africa and i used to pay rent monthly in liberia you pay rent six months or yearly do you understand and comparing the prices is quite cheaper compared to south africa or nigeria where i used to live too so that's one thing you can say that you know liberia has an upper hand on so yeah like a studio apartment in liberia will cost you hundred dollar us you understand that's way cheap in fact that's too cheap yeah we have light but water is a problem but then again people go with an option of having a borehole in you know their complex or their houses and flats you understand which is a very good way to go then you don't have to pay water bills and all type of things so that's one of the best things i love about my country liberia so the next thing i would like to talk about is food liberians make the best food ever ask any foreigner that visited liberia they would tell you yo the country is like this is like that but the food oh my god the food is so nice so this is what i would tell you if you plan on coming to liberia to settle or to visit or just to see what's going on around here in West Africa. You understand? Know that the food is amazing here. I'll give you a list of food to try right now. You understand? I'll put it in the description. You understand? I'll give you a list. If you've been to Liberia and you're watching this video, I would like for you to comment down below in the comment section with a heart sign. Then I'll know that, hey, you've been here. You've tasted the food, my guy. <laughs> okay. And the next thing I would like to talk about is the amount of freedom we have here in Liberia. When I used to live outside the country, you know, some other parts of the world i realized that things like public drinking weren't allowed but in liberia public drinking is <laughs> nobody cares bro like a cop car can be passing and you be right on the street drinking nobody cares bro there's so much freedom in this country you understand and that's one thing i like about my country liberia now i've listed you know the bad and the good i don't want for you to only hear it from me so i'm gonna be going out in the street and asking people what do you like about liberia what do you hate about liberia you understand let's go it's gonna be fun trust me What's up? Cool, bro. So just state your name and tell me what you like about Liberia and your dislike or what you think we can improve on as a country. First of all, uh, my name is James Collingwood, but famously people refer to me as Blackberry, the design of the Bible. Okay. Yeah, but what I really love in my country is that, you know, just the freedom in the country being free. Yeah. Yeah, well, you, you walk in a town, any day, any, anywhere free, no one can harm you. I, I love that. And you're free to and do anything you free want to do. do anything you want to do but yeah. I, in, in in different countries you know some sometimes it's not like that yeah yeah people die on a regular basis and also what i love about of my, of my country is that some natural resources that I, that I will have yeah yeah although it's, it's not being manifest in our own life but also, I love my country because natural disasters don't just happen exactly. in our country like that, like earthquakes, you no know, like tsunamis, like like different different natural disasters like like in place in Asia yeah. don't happen in, in my country. So for for that reason, you know, I I, I I feel cool with that. That's great. That's so, great. So so what what else? What do you think we can improve on as a country, or what are your dislikes? My my dislike about the country is that the country don't promote number one. Yeah. When it comes to talent, okay. we have talent in this country. We have game. When you but, say talent, what do you mean? You mean like oh, really? music? Oh, uh, yeah, uh, just, poetry. I mean dancing. I mean just everything about talent, about game, about gift, bro. Yeah. Yeah. The country don't promote us. We have talent. We have a game here. So we need somebody, or we need people that will come and help us. We need people that will come and invest in talent, okay. in games. Yeah. yeah. In the youth. Okay. So the country have to work on that, bro. All right, thank you. Yeah, thank all right. you so much. Yeah, bro. All right. What's up? What's up? What's up? I'm okay. So just state your name and tell us what you like about Liberia and what you dislike, or what you think you know we can improve on as a country. Uh, I'm Emmanuel P. Saki. Yeah. Uh, like Jesus DJ, aka DJ Warbuck. Yeah. I'm a Liberian. Uh, better by trap. Yeah. And see, I came, I came to be as a Liberian. Wow, well, wow! Some of the things I really love of my country is uh, their way of living, like the culture, the food. Yeah, the um, food, the food, nice, eh? Yeah, the food nice, the, the way of living, like we got the 15 tribes, everybody got their own way of doing things. Yeah. The, the, the unity and the peace over the time. You know, so a lot of good things, like we talk about the terrorism, 
We got a lot of good people that come from all of the country, right? The tourism. The tourism and see a lot of good things. Okay. Uh, we got a little pop of water. We got we got a little city right now. We got we got some 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 level of real connectivities. A lot of good things is in the country. The education is is, is somehow progressing on, on 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 a little average every 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 day. For the matter of fact, my country every day is getting a little bit better. That's a lot a lot of things I really love my country. Okay. Well, what do you think we can improve on, or what do you what what are, what are your things like? What I don't really like about the country is how politicians do that things. Okay. Yeah. How they made the country to be like, if you import it, you, you can't do anything. Yeah. We got a lot of talented people. Let, 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 let's forget about poverty. Let, 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 let's go to art and culture. Let, you know, let, let's go to talents. See, see a lot of young people, talented people are all around, but the country don't promote. They only say go do poverty, go do poverty. This is one of the things I really hate about the country. Yeah. About everything is poverty. Go out there, spot talent or bring us some, some program. Make the youth, you know, very proactive. Yeah. Make them to, 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 to do those things that they like yeah. doing. Create avenue. Yeah. It's not only about poverty. That's one of the things I really hate about like bro. That way of doing things, especially in politics. Okay. All right, thank you, thank you, sir. So just state your name, tell me what you love about your country, Liberia, and what are the things we need to improve on or what you don't like. I'm Eugene M. James, actually. This is my country, mm -hmm. hmm? Liberia. I love my country because I'm a qualified citizen. Okay. Things that support the country is the leader. The leaders? Yeah, the leaders support our country, but actually our country is not bad. When the day we care who leader, everything will be well with us. But what are the things, the main things that you like? about the country beyond Liberia. What you yeah. can say, why? You like the food, you like, you know, the June. <laughs> uh, no, <laughs> not a matter of the June. Yeah, okay, yeah. Okay. for me, I can say part of my country because where I live in my life, I enjoy it in school. Yeah. Whatever I want, I have it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so my country is good with me. Okay, okay. Yeah. Right. So you enjoy the country regardless? Yeah, yeah. the only thing that they like in the country, you know? Yeah. yeah, but as for me, I enjoy my country. I okay. get no feedback from my country. All right. All right, so thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. All right. So state your name and tell me what you love about Liberia and tell me what you think we should improve on as a country. I love about Liberia. We are president doing good things for us. I will say the president is not working. I will say the president is working. I will say the good thing again is about Liberia. The president is working? Yeah. So so what, what else? What else you, what else you like about the country? What else do you, you think that we can improve on as a country? Country by to improve the country. I don't come and find job for all. The youth, eh? Yeah. So they should find job for the youth. Yeah. Oh, okay. So the country will go far. Okay. All right. Thank you. All right. Okay. So state your name and tell me what you like about your country, Liberia, and you know what you think we can improve on as a nation or what you don't like, your dislike. Emmanuel Judunun Gerens Jr. Mr. G, Kamba Gaza. You say, what do you want to know again from me? My name who? Your name and what you like about Oh, country. straight to the business. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you wanted to know where I'm from. Bon Gante begin. Okay, straight to the business. Uh, what we like about the country? Like, bro, sweet. I mean, when a woman know how to cook, I mean, the tobacco can be nice. What else can I mean? The, the, the weather can be nice sometimes too. Ain't see like when it's, uh, when you're ready that dry season, then this is the time. If you are not a dry season person, then come when it's rainy. Yeah. But you don't have no autumn and no snow and good. We got good mountain sites out there. I mean, good tourist sites. And somebody who like outer sites. But if you're somebody who not like outside, nah, nah, they really outside there. Other than that, those are, I mean, if I, I don't even think what I need anything I good about because let me just put it at it. I'm still looking for what I really like and what I like. I love the women. I love the food. Yeah. I love my people. My boy, I love working on our country because it, 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 we're not getting there. I mean, we say we're getting there, but let's see that we're getting there. Half step in a year, right? like a half step a year, half step a year. That's how we're getting there. It's not fast enough. We're working on a road project now. Why? I beg you, and you see the Kimmy that it did see, but I tell you your reality. That only because the man knows in one position, but so they are cut out, they must finish it before say, hey, let me say you. But let me know, on a, on a serious matter, we got a whole lot of work to do from when I was growing up and what I was hearing about my country, what we read in books, what our parents told us, how they lived. We're not seeing none of that. We the younger generation, we the post-war generation, or whatever you'll call us, we are not seeing, we're not benefiting squat. If I'm lying, somebody say you lying. I mean, a few ripe apples don't mean that everything's green, but it's the country. You gotta love it. Gotta love it. <laughs> All right, thanks, man. 
So state your name and tell me what you like about Liberia and your dislike. My name is Satola Satawie. Yeah. And I'm a Liberian by birth, by nationality, everything. Yeah. And I love Liberia for the fact that Liberian we are tough, yeah. yeah. We can make it anyway. But right now, at this point, what I don't like about Liberia is the security system is poor. Yeah, it's very, very poor. So they are saying that the youth are Everybody for that matter, they be the young adult, everybody feel insecure in the country. So I already be glad if the government of Liberia and the people of Liberia, the ministers and everybody will work hard and you know to secure the country so that we we'll feel safe in the night, in the day, anywhere, anytime. Okay. Whether there is light or not, we we'll feel safe because we know there is security system or the country is secure. Okay. That's all. Alright, thank you so much. Alright. So guys, that's it for today's video. I wish I interviewed more female, but you know, they were feeling a little bit shy, so I just had to let them be. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to the channel. This channel is all about African arts and culture from a Liberian point of view. And like always, I'm your favorite Liberian boy. Until next time, peace.